Welcome back, folks. In the last episode, we probably created a lot of orphans and widows, and we found some part of a weapon. And I don't know why I went into this room again. I wanted to check something out. Namely, whether there's this any point. This is supposed to be a stealth mission. No, there's no point. Okay, but I can't enter the room, at least. But they can still shoot me. They can shoot me rather well. Uh, yeah, there's no point. In wasting time. Okay, let's... Okay, we have to go to the next level, to a lower level. Hmm. Jimmy, go for help! Jimmy, this is supposed to be ah. a stealth mission. Okay. Yeah, I have to give this game some credits. I mean, even though... I mean, you have to picture this. That this game came out at the same time as Quake 2. And maybe to modern, for modern standards this game doesn't seem so extraordinary, but compared to... Yeah, your average first-person shooter, like Quake 2 for instance, this game is rather, rather amazing actually. <gasps> they have failed to found, find any secrets so far. Maybe it wasn't actually a secret here. Maybe I'm supposed to go this way? Uh, can I go any further? Let me turn off the lights here. Or not the lights of the game, but the lights of my room. What, was the, what is the point in going in breaking this? Uh, can I break this floor? No. Doesn't seem like I could break this floor. But I see some weapon flying around there. I'm missing something. Uh, I can't. Oh, I can't go back up there. Let's turn this off. A bit puzzled here. Can cross under and I can. Can I? No, I can't cross over this. I cannot destroy those pipes. Uh, what's it? Maybe I have to check, uh, we check this, 
For now, <coughs> sorry. For now, we will leave this mystery to itself, and I will try to find the um, the entrance to the next level. I'm really not sure where I'm supposed to go now. Ah, there. Yeah. Um. Before we go, I would like to explore a bit more. Okay, I'm just checking whether there's actually any point in going in here. Um, blade is down. I repeat, blade is down. I don't think so. I don't think there's any point in going into this room. for me to go in there. Hmm. Where was this? Where was this voice coming from? There was no no point in going up here. Um, I think. I thought I heard something. I'm gonna go check. No, we didn't hear. Didn't hear anything. Skull. Oh, my skull. Oh. Oh, already got it. Already got it. But at least I get to destroy some furniture. I just have to be more skilled, I think. Hmm. Okay. And 
I think I have to jump. Ah. This, yeah, folks, this could take a while. Just watch me being incapable. <sighs> being absolutely unable to solve this jumping puzzle. I will eventually solve this jumping puzzle. <sighs> Given enough time, I will... I will eventually solve this jumping puzzle, so... Game... Just let me solve this jumping puzzle. Okay. Maybe I should... Just be a bit slower. Trying the slow approach. Okay, I'm. Hmm. One, two, three. Yep. Yeah. Well, that's a uh, that's a very very long um, ventilation shaft, and it goes up there. I just hope this is worth it. I think it's safe to walk on this ventilator. It is actually. Okay, what is the point of getting killed? Okay. Now I have destroyed the power to the ventilator. To the ventilator? The ventilation system, which means that yeah. So what exactly have I achieved here? And this just leads me to the room. Hmm. I think this is a room. No, it's not. Uh. I think I reload this mainly because I don't think that it was very smart of me um, to waste this health and to jump down this jump jump down this uh This hole. Okay. I'm always checking if there's anything suspicious looking. Because I haven't found any secrets so far. Even though. Um, this part in the shower room definitely looked like a secret and I will hopefully have found a secret or have made some progress and we will make progress when we come back folks so until next time folks until then